Hello, good evening. So we encountered an issue when printing things like this, which have big amount of surface area which sits on the bed like that. If you pull these things off, it will be very hard without the thinner stick. Then, we don't have thinner stick. So, what we used was this. It's invisible tape. Uh, comes with a matte finish. It's very nice. It's also, I think it's just a dollar or two dollars for the three rolls here. I don't know which one's cheaper, if the painter stick or this one. But if you can't find any painter stick in your part of the world, you can use this one. It works pretty well. It's a little bit messy to clean off. Oh, well, it's not that hard to clean it off very nice so we just applied a bunch of here and we'll print things like this with uh, very large surface areas so that we can pop them off easily so we just apply a bunch of them they have matte finish they feel good I haven't really tried painters tape I'll try to buy one tomorrow but for now we don't have any so we'll, we'll just use this painter tape it's also pretty pretty thin I think it will work for you too it worked well for us uh, see this side is clean this side is clean too top side and the painter's tape was here no issues at all we're gonna print a bunch more so here's the invisible tape in action focus. as you can see there's a little bit of gap here and there well it's not really a problem because the invisible tape is too thin for it to affect the print quality. Especially when we get to more than two layers, maybe a third layer, it won't really matter the, the gaps. So that's it. Maybe tomorrow I'll find some painter's tape and compare the two. Here are more invisible tape in action. You can see very nice prints. No major issues at all. Nice. Maybe I don't have to buy painter's tape.